burst of mm -hmm. wind. I was just watching the traffic camera as you were it's saying moving. that. That camera started bobbling mm -hmm. around out there as he was giving that heads up to Laura Smith, which is where we're headed next. That's right. Storm Team 2's Laura Smith is out in downtown Charleston. And Josh said some rain is heading your way, way um, Laura. How's it shaping up down there this morning? Yeah, I heard Josh saying that. Thanks for giving me the heads up, Josh. We are waiting on that rain. We can feel that rain uh, starting to pick up here a little bit, but still not too bad. We've seen a couple of runners here, uh, the Ashley River. We're near the city marina right here off of Lockwood, where it meets Broad by the Coast Guard Station, but really not bad other than that sustained wind, 20 to 30 miles per hour. We've got this gust that uh, picks up over 40 miles per hour here at times. Uh, but when it comes to flooding, that was the big issue here in downtown Charleston. I live downtown and I haven't seen really big issues in on these roads other than some water on the roads. Be careful if you are driving out and about. But other than that, no big concern over flooding from what we've seen. We do see a couple tree limbs down, but nothing um, major. I did talk to the city of Charleston here today. They went through a briefing at 830 this morning, going to give us an update here today at some point. But they tell us all in all, mostly quiet. Uh, we're very lucky, very thankful that we were not part of the, the major impacts from Hurricane Florence. But a nasty day. Stay inside. Enjoy some football family time while you have it. And um, I will go ahead and send it back to you guys. But all in all, really not so bad. Just stay inside. But that wind, it's going. And that certainly is the case here on this Saturday. Downtown Charles and Laura Smith count on two. Definitely not a fun day out there. Go